Good morning. This is day 13. God loves a cheerful giver. 2 Corinthians chapter 9 verse 7. It is for the Lord. Written by Richard W. Dehan. Author James Duff tells of the time when English pastor and theologian Andrew Fuller was collecting money for foreign missions. One of his contacts was an old friend. When presented with the need, the man said, Well, Andrew, seeing it's you, I'll give you five pounds. No, said Fuller, I can't take your money for my cause, seeing that it is for me. And he handed the man the money back. The man saw his point. He said, Andrew, you're right. Here's ten pounds, seeing that it is for Jesus Christ. Duff concluded, let us remember, it is not the amount we give toward helping the Lord's work. It is the motive that he looks at. Proper motives are essential in Christian service, whether it's money or time or talents. The Lord is more concerned with why we give than with how much we give. We should never give to receive the praise of others, but because we love God and desire to see his name honored and glorified. The Apostle Paul said, let each one give as he purposes in his heart, not grudgingly or of necessity, for God loves a cheerful giver. Whenever we give to the work of God, may we honestly say it is for the Lord. Give as you would do the master if you met his searching look. Give as you would of your substance if his hand took the offering. A quote this morning reads, God sees the giver as well as the gift, the heart, as well as the hand. End 